So, I've been hankering for some salads lately. And I love ones that are real bad for you. <laughs> so, uh, that means uh, blue cheese dressing and Caesar dressing. Those are my two favorites. So, uh, I think today we're gonna do some, some Caesar dressing. What do you think? But first, the most important part, the then cooking experience. Super, super easy. I'm not doing it the bougie way today. We're doing it the cheap ass way today. So, um, that, which means we're using pre-made mayo and anchovy paste versus like regular anchovies and fucking croutons. Cause I don't feel like making my own croutons. I do, I have a problem with that, just not today. All right, so I'm putting in about two cups in there. We're gonna put in about two tablespoons of the anchovy paste. If you're using regular anchovies, that's fine. Just, you know, chop them up and add them in. Same volume. Worcester sauce. Worcestershire. Worcestershire. Worcestershire sauce. Some lemon juice. Everybody knows every time you pop open Dijon, it explodes out. It's so messy to use that thing. Salt and pepper, I got my one to four mix. We may need to add more. And the most important, got me some Parmesan Reggio. Prince of Cheeses. This is a 22 month age step. Oh, it's so good. About a half cup of this, I think. All right, so we're gonna give this a light mix. You will not be able to mix this to the consistency you want. I mean, you could leave it like this, but you're gonna have to put it in a blender or something to get a, a smoother consistency as well as blend out that anchovy paste. And if you use regular anchovies, you're just still gonna probably need to do the same thing. You don't have to, again, it's fine to leave it a little rustic. You ever notice how rustic always means chunky? Taste twice. It's definitely salty enough. You can taste the Dijon, it tastes the mustard. Lemon juice, definitely can taste the onion, uh, the uh, anchovies. Let's try. The only thing left I'm going to do, throw a blender. Cheers. Till next time, friends.